Filthy pervert. Do you want to tell everyone what you've been fantasizing over this week? No. I'll tell them. Fantasizing, talking in public about, oh, it, it turns me on, it makes me feel right dirty inside. The Lenore advert. The Lenore advert. The little white bits of cloth that dance around. They're all different colours. They're all, yeah, exactly. Not denying it. Yeah. Deny it. The Lenore advert turns you on. I like it. It's a nice world to live in. Everything's soft and clean and smells nice. Cloth. Like, like the soft mints advert from a few years ago, Mr. Soft. You'd oh, love you to live there, wouldn't you? Well, you want to hang on a minute. You want to bang Mr. Soft? I don't want to bang Mr. Soft. Mr. Soft, how comes you look so weird? Who's that creepy guy <laughs> behind you? How are you doing, Mr. Soft? It would just be a nice word. When to I'm live done in. with you, you won't be called Mr. Soft anymore. You'll be called Mr. Weeping in the Corner. <laughs> Try mints, or I'll come. <laughs> <laughs> but explain oh, this Lenore thing. I just like it. I find that, you know, they, they dance really sexy. The the like little dancing sexy cloth. The little bits of cloth that are on the Lenore. Do you sometimes see a plastic bag in the wind and think? Mm. No, I'm not into plastic. I'm into plastic. But cloths. Just, explain this to me. Clean like, cause... and soft. Like you know, when you put on a nice jumper and it's nice. Yeah, I don't think you oh, can have sex I shall have it. sex with this. Yeah, obviously, because you know it's a jumper. But a cloth makes it all right? If it was a person, a lady... I don't understand. That, that's what I'm intrigued by. I'm not entirely sure of what I'm talking about, but, but do you, you just go with it, don't you, if it makes you feel nice. Do you get what they call in the industry Dick Tingle? <laughs> no, I can't have him round anymore. He keeps knocking my jigsaws off the table. <laughs> but how does it make you feel? Is it kind of a... No, a it's just a bit of fun. It's just a bit of fun. It's I don't get genuinely aroused by it. But if I had a choice between living in this world and that one, I'd choose that one. Is that right? Oh, yeah. Imagine that. It'd be like Pleasantsville, just switching on your telly to see the Lenore advert and just see you dancing around. But you know what would happen? You'd get there and go, not for me, this. Yeah. No, I thought it'd be great, this Lenore land, but I hate it. you got to have dreams, though, aren't you? You do, yeah. Where do you want to live? Um, I'd quite like to be um, in Knight Rider. Right. You know, just hanging out with uh, with Kit. Yeah. Quite Riding like... your bike. No. Bring, bring. All right, Michael. How's it going? Solved any cases? No, I'd quite like to be. What else? I, I said last week, I'd do the uh, Big Cat Diary. It'd be yeah. fantastic. And at the minute, I've got this real obsession with going to a foreign country and getting drunk. You were talking about this earlier, but you don't drink and you don't speak any foreign languages. Yeah. That's just going to be you at an airport. Getting drunk. Yeah. Sad, isn't it? You asked for, he asked for a whiskey this week. Someone, James Dowdsworth very nicely bought me a bottle of whiskey and we decided to have a little nip. It was great, though, And you yeah. got all excited. I shall have one of those. I did, and I knew you weren't going to drink it. I did. You, didn't, you had about one sip of it. Oh, and then you stuff. cried for 20 minutes. Yeah. Then you had to go to the toilet. And then you came back and replaced it with apple juice, thinking no one would notice. <laughs> yeah, I'm having a point of it. Are you, Russell? Okay. What was great about it is lovely um, because um, James, our friend, who's got, uh, he, you know, he's got, incredibly wonky eyes as have I but what's great when he gets really drunk you can just see them zo -yo -yo -yo, and get really kind of they, <laughs> they, they, nice to them, mate? they go zo -yo -yo -yo, and they get quite straight it's fantastic and he's just got this lovely glazed view and from nowhere the other day he just went do you want some whiskey he pulled out this kind of quite um it's quite an old nice whiskey isn't it sheep for you? dip yeah sheep dip mm. and he is fantastic uh, he went do you want some John and John said with the now famous words I can't have whiskey I get <laughs> Very naughty. <laughs> like that. So I'm not, uh, I'm not supposed to have whiskey. It's great. Don't you love it when you, you hear, like, n normally a mad uncle at a party will go that, Oh, do you want some gin? I can't have gin. Yeah. No, gin turns me weird. No, it's you that turns you weird. Um, we've had a really great email in. Morning, we guys. We never have. We have, mate.